So then when you practice and like you come to a challenging pose or something, what can you kind of tell me sort of the steps that you sort of take in order to go through it and go as deep as you possibly can with it as opposed to just giving up or yeah yeah that, that, I mean that's the really really hard part what you're talking about because it's just and there's such a razor's edge to that you know like that they talk about that yoga is walking the razor's edge and that that so one side is you know either side the it's so easy to fall off that edge because you're right if you there's a certain giving up quality that it's just too hard you know it's just going to be too hard and so you know so to even try you know and then but then so what's the other side of that <laughs> Well, I think the other, the other side, side of it is pushing yourself so hard that you become agitated or just hurt yourself or... Right, or, or you just totally have no satisfaction. You're just, like, you you run up against the, your, how, you know, just your, your self-hatred, your self-criticism, yeah. like, that you don't, you don't like where you are, and... You're not good enough. You're not good enough. Right. Right. And so, and just how to negotiate those is just, just really tough. I mean, but that is the whole, that, that's a lot of what goes on. You know, like, and why Kapotasana is such a dreaded pose is just because for, for most people, there's, there's no getting around it then. It's like, I mean, there really feels like the choice between giving up or just yeah not being good enough or trying too hard or you know and so I do what you what you said is there's there's a sort of vinyasa or a sequence of actions that set up the posture and that is based on principles that have to do with breathing and rhythm and alignment of the skeleton and I, I work with those to the best of my ability and I, I try to find the soulful movement, so the, the soulful place to be within those parameters. And, and then make the best effort I can, the, the full effort, and, and at the same time, be satisfied with it, you know? Actually, I'd, I'd rather try hard and feel bad about myself than give up. Right. You know, so generally I'll try. Because giving up, I mean, where is it going to go from there? You know, and I just don't, uh, I'm definitely of the school that to progress in yoga, to go deep into yoga requires a lot of power, a lot of will, a lot of effort. Commitment. Yeah, and even pain, you just it, it's so hard, and that you have to re renew that effort each time, and that of course there's there's bliss, there's just being and letting go, and there's a certain orientation of body and mind that has a softness to it and a receptivity, but without that real struggle. You're, it's not going far. <laughs>